What's up guys, today I'm going to be putting some new parts on my scooter. One of the parts I got are these orange ODI grips. ODI grips are my absolute favorite grips just because they're soft right whenever you get them. You do not have to boil them or break them in or anything like that. And the reason I really like them is because they are pretty short and that means you're going to be farther to the ends of your bars. That means you'll be getting more leverages for kicklesses and other whip tricks. The next part I got are these Lucky Toaster Wheels. As you can see, I did get one green and one blue. But I have been really enjoying the Lucky Toaster Wheels in 100mm, just because I feel like it's a lot easier to do tricks with smaller wheels. So now that you guys have seen the parts, I'm gonna time lapse me putting these on my scooter, and then we're gonna go to the skate park and get some clips. Okay guys, all the scooter parts are on now and the scooter looks really good, except for the grip tape. You can see everything is pretty much all new, except for the grip tape. The grip tape looks super bad, so y'all are gonna get a tutorial on how to clean your grip tape. So what you'll need to clean your grip tape is a scrubber, something like this. This will take all of the dirt and mud off of your grip tape. And you will need some soap. First things first, get your grip tape wet and then just put one pump of soap on it and that should be good. Now get your scrubber and make sure to wet the bristles and scrub it around for about five minutes. Okay guys, so now once your grip tape is all soapy, just use a hose to rinse off all of the soap and your grip tape will be clean. Now that the grip tape is clean, the scooter looks so much better. Now we're gonna go to the skate park and get some clips. Yeah. 